Well, I'm uh, preparing a little barbecue for the family. This will be uh, yeah, number three since I've been here. It's another fine, exciting, hot day in the Philippines. So today I prepared a little stuff, some uh, pork chops, some steak, chicken, do some corn on the cob, baked beans and potatoes, everything on the grill. So I've just been washing off the uh, taters in the sink. Gonna get everything ready, bring it outside, and we'll take a look in a minute. So as we move forward, woo, we got some potatoes, corn, more corn that I seasoned. No meat yet on the grill, but we will get to that. <coughs> hey. And here my cousin, Ensign Nair. He's uh, providing oversight, Q&A. He's like, a, he's an engineer. Yeah, no, no, I'm not an engineer. <laughs> Something like that. So uh, he's providing moral support <laughs> as we uh -oh. Let him say. Hello. Everybody. Hey. Hello. Hello <laughs> so, I need to go start the baked beans because I'm going to grill everything. So, we're checking back in again on our uh, family barbecue with me and Ensign there. Ensign means cousin. So, we got the grill going. Show you what all we have on the menu for tonight. So, got some barbecue beans. I just went to the store and bought a whole bunch of different types of beans and fried up some onions and pepper and stuff and made up a little barbecue sauce. Got the potatoes and the corn going back there. Once they get about done, I'm gonna take them out, put some smoke to everything. And here on the table, we got some pork chops and some chicken. Of course, we got a bottle of Jack Daniels just, just in case we need it. <clears throat> so we're about to throw in the chicken and we'll do the steaks last because I want to make sure that done. I made up in the green bowl down here. Some little, just something to baste it with, some barbecue sauce and beer. And I bought Tony Chachery, some Cajun Creole seasoning and steak seasoning. A lot of things with me from the States. So, we're about to burn some meat, as they say in the States. So, from the Philippines. Beautiful day today. Sitting underneath the palm trees in the garden. There's my cousin there, chilling out. He's having a good time. But I love him, he's here, he always comes and stays with us. Of course, we gave him a room up here in one of the new rooms that were built. I said, you got air conditioning and everything there. So, but he's a blessing to have, I love him. Helps me out a lot. So we, you know, this is a family day because the grandbaby is here and all. So, stay tuned for more to come because we cooking today. So folks, as we check back in again, <clears throat> smoking up the neighborhood. Almost messed up that one. Let me get my spoon. <clears throat> More flavor for the fire. So, lost the little beans on that one. Not yet hot. Not yet. So here's another view. So we just we just smoking up the neighborhood. We're gonna cook a whole lot of stuff tonight. We still gotta get to the uh, 
do all this and all this in this yard without this guy. He helped my wife out a lot during lockdown. So I'm just saying thank you. We forced him to stay here today, Sunday. He was going to leave us. Just have a barbecue. Just to do a little bit to say how much we love him and how much we thank him. Nothing like family. So that's what we're doing, burning up some meat. We close this up. I got a corn trying to get away. Yeah, this hot, so don't touch it. Very hot. Very hot pot. So, there we go. Now we got it. Oh, wait, wait. Yep, I was about to mess up. Whoosh. So, now it's closed. We'll check back in a little bit later without messing up anything, I hope. So as we check back in on the grill, if I don't get smoked out, woo, chicken is looking beautiful. Big beans finally started cooking actually. <clears throat> Let me give them a little stir. And a little taste. They got a good smoke taste to them. So I just uh, made up a little barbecue and beer marinade to keep the chicken from drying out, but it's going good. It's going really good, I have to say. <clears throat> when that's about done, or done, we're gonna go to some pork chops. And some hot dogs too, I forgot about that. Do a little hot dog for the grandbaby. So, that's the latest <clears throat> from Neversiha. This is Ensign Nair and Cullen. Well, I'm Cullen. That's, <laughs> that's my cousin Nair. He's taking a video of me because he's sending it to their friends and they're calling him. So, Make sure this ain't burning. Cause the grill is very hot. But it's going good. So, we're gonna close her up and for a couple minutes, baste it and come back again. Here we go, slowly, boom. There we go. Look at that smoke. So, We'll check back in a little later. So checking back in on the grill process, you see it is nighttime in the Philippines. Well, getting to be is evening. One of the solar lights came on. The other one is about to. Get a little light on the smoke. Let me get over here. Now we got some pork chops going, the chicken and the corn. And the potatoes are done. Just got some pork chops and hot dogs. And last but not least, in this blue-green container will be the, some steaks will be thrown on. And it'll be time to eat. So, only problem is, we don't really have nobody up on the terrace. And we have a flame on. So, a little beer will cool that down. So, flame is gone. Anyway, I don't see nobody, so nobody must be hungry. So we'll just donate all this food to charity. No, they'll be here, especially when I cook the steaks. So that's the latest and greatest from the Philippines. There he's still uh, working on something on Facebook, sending pictures. People pictures of him drinking this and see the, t the cap isn't even broken. So, <laughs> 
We haven't gotten that far yet. That'll be later at cocktail hour. All right, we're almost done. We're in the final run. We're in the end game. So we'll check back in again a little later. So folks, we are checking in again on the food and just marinated the pork chops. And these pieces here were these big thick pork pieces were a gift in the States from my sister-in-law. And uh, my daughter is trying to sing songs and mess me all up. I'm asking her to wait. <laughs> but you know, we're in the Philippines and folks want to sing. So, hot dogs don't take long to get ready. So we're gonna put all this up there in the warmer smoking myself out here and then the last thing we throw in on here is some steaks so put these hot dogs back in the cooler and we're gonna check in on my wife who's babysitting Jaren, the newest member of the family. Hi. Me again. It's time I'm Lola and Grandma. Yeah. Lola means grandma. Yeah. I'm She's grandma. Lola and I'm Lolo. <laughs> grandpa. I'm low. She's high. <laughs> So I got the camera light on, so I don't want to get too close to the baby and blind her. So, feeding time. Mom is, where's Christine? I'll just take a walk, visiting. Uh, house next door. Visiting Apple. I mean, no one. Oh, okay. Oh. Mosquitoes. Okay. <clears throat> We're gonna. He's, he's falling asleep. All, all she does is sleep. He said he is nothing. He's pretending. He he been taking pictures of this with the Jack Daniels bottle. Yeah. Like he's drinking. How about the seal is still on the bottle and everything? Okay. <laughs> so I'm like I'm like you're faking it. <laughs> But anyway, we got the tables set up, and uh, I don't know where the crew is to eat, but we're ready to eat. So we're gonna take a little break. The little baby is just, she only stays awake long enough to eat. And look at her, she's out. What a life. We'll zoom in. There she is. Look at that beautiful birthmark. <clears throat> it's like a big tear. Isn't she just a darling little angel? Oh, there is la mort. All right. Come on. I... The mosquito is so big. Why don't y'all all go in yeah. and I'll move all the food yeah. and spray everything down, wait about 10 minutes, and then you come yeah, back. Yeah, I have to... Because that's what I wanted to do anyway. Yeah, okay. All right, so, so check in later, Bye. people. We'll, we're about to throw some chemical agent. Check in again later. So we check in back in again, which is the last thing on the grill. Here is some beef that was given to me by my sister-in-law. So I marinated it and, uh, and there's my lovely bride. Yes, sweetheart. Hi. It's me again. So are we gonna eat? Yeah, I was just cooking the steaks. Everything else is ready. Okay. So we are going to start now. Yes, you may. So as I was saying, the steaks were a gift from my sister-in-law. So I just cut it up. It was a big hunk of meat. 
I cut it up, threw some seasoning on it, let it marinate a little bit. And my Asawa, which means wife, is so happy. Look how cute she looks. She looks like she's going to the beach. Yeah, because it's too hot here. Oh, you, you're you too hot. That's what it is. Well, I'm too hot. Oh, yeah. Too hot, so baby. Be careful not to get, to get burned. <laughs> oh, burn me up, darling. I'm burning you up. Mm -hmm. So, family's gathering, and we're about to eat. <clears throat> so, I'm just waiting for the steaks to get done because that's what Dion is. It's hot, sweetie. You don't have to put your head up there. It's hot. So, let me flip these over. Me, I'll take it medium rare, but. My son, he hasn't really tried steak. Well, he has because I bought him some the other day and we grilled them a week ago. So this is his. There he is sitting up there, patiently waiting for that. So, hope it's good. <clears throat> My cousin was asking me what kind of beef is it? I'm like, I don't know, it's beef. But it's Philippines or whatever. Well, we're gonna try it out. There, the kids having fun, being chased by the little dogs. See what these look like. Oh yeah, they're going good. Getting the good. Yep. Let them stay right there for a little bit. Don't fuss with it. And we'll check back in in a little bit. So, coming back again, steaks are about done, and a little blood beating, so maybe a little bit longer, because they want them well done. So before we close out, we take a look at the family to see how they doing and liking everything. So we have our first, this is my son, he's waiting for steak. But you see, he's got a plate of chicken, taters, and baked beans. Yes. And son, he's, uh, you know, he's my trusty assistant. Watching me, drinking all the Jack Daniels. <laughs> and there's the lovely, my daughter, Christine. Look at her. Let's see what she gets. Let's see what mama is getting. Corn. So, hope you all like it. Thank you for it's all this is what it's all about <laughs> family and it's a little different so there's all the food and I didn't make no rice I'm sorry I, I, I know Beck wants some rice see she's just dying <laughs> There's the cute little ones. Here, here. Can you hold the camera while I open of your phone? I can. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 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 Here, it's time for you to eat too. Yeah, well, I have to Okay. I'm going to eat I'm going to eat What can you say about this, that food? Mr. De Leon. Aina, Aina. Eat. Hmm. Hmm. 
Pogian mo na yan, anak. Nahiya ka. Pogi, pogi mo. Nahiya ka. Masarap. Masarap, sarap eh. Hmm. Can I pause it pa? These two here are having a great time. Yes. See that one? Wow. <laughs> so it's like everybody's quiet, so you know they're quiet. They must be hungry. So put take the steaks off of here. And I am done as well. And we will close this out. So we will close this out as another successful barbecue in the Philippines with my family. So we got four days left before we journey back to Germany. I'd like to thank everybody. So there it is. My call family. Thank you again for joining us. Peace out.